Hey everybody, I'm coming at you from a bedroom today because what I want to do is really walk you through some different exercises, some different stretches that you can do at home to help out with your sciatica. So again, I'm in a bedroom right now and I'm going to walk you through some things that can be done right here on a bed, on your bed at home, to make sure that you aren't dealing with the sciatic symptoms as much this year as you were last year. So it's three really, really simple exercises and it's simply the three different ranges of motion with your low back. Now again, the reason that we're looking at the low back when we look at sciatica is because the nerves that go all the way down the leg causing sciatica actually start right here in the low back. So they exit here and they go down the back side of the butt and down the back side of the leg exactly where people experience sciatica. So I want to walk you through those three different exercises and again it's the three ranges of motion so it should be really easy to remember. The first one is going to be done with your hands on your knees and you're going to go side to side. Okay, So through the full range of motion of your spine, the neck and your low back, side to side. And you want to make sure that you're doing this on a bed or something soft like this because that way you have more give in your hips. So you're going to go side to side, you're going to do 20 to the right and 20 to the left. The next item that you can do is a different range of motion. You're going to put your hands up like this and you're going to rotate to the right and then you're going to rotate to the left. Okay, and you're going to go just like that, 20 to the right and 20 to the left. Then the last range of motion, you guessed it, is front and back. So you're going to start again with your hands on your knees, you're going to go all the way forward, and then you're going to go all the way back. So this one is a little special, it's kind of like cat and cow if, if, if you've ever done yoga, except you're doing it seated. You're going to tuck your tummy way in when you go forward, and then you're going to extend that low back all the way forward when you extend into this way, okay? So those three ranges of motion, side to side, rotation, and then front and back. Now the key with this, especially if you're experiencing excruciating sciatic pain, is that you only want to go um, to a very gentle regimen with this exercise routine. So you're not you know, being very, very intense with it and, and going to the point of where it's really causing you pain. You just want to be super gentle, go through the full range of motion, but if you do feel pain, you want to make sure that you stop because you don't want to aggravate it more. Now this routine is really, really good um, for a lot of people that are experiencing sciatica, and um, especially if, if the symptoms aren't super severe. However, if this doesn't fix your sciatica or give you long-term relief, make sure that you contact me at Deep Roots Health Center because I actually have a full regimen of thousand plus different stretches and exercises that I can look at to see if we can put something together that would definitely help out your sciatica for the long term and actually fix that cause of the problem. So again, this is a really good thing if it works for you and if it doesn't, just contact me and, and we can put together a really specialized regimen for your individual case in the office. So if you got something out of this video, make sure that you comment, tag, or share below and I will catch you on a future video.